I've talked to a lot of old timers. Black fishermen. Most of them talk about the Provo. A few of them talk about the Green River. They talk about how good the fishing was back in the 60s and 70s. Um, I think the fishing's pretty good. I think the fishing's pretty good. I always wonder about possible uh, drought, possible drought, drought, water levels. Water levels. Are we gonna have trout? How big are they gonna be? How healthy are they going to be? How lucky we are to live where we do. Is it luck I was born here? Water levels. Fate. Why do I love rivers so much? Why do some people not care at all? Our beautiful Utah, our beautiful trout. What's really interesting is that it takes pristine water to grow animals like this. It takes crystal clear, beautiful, clean water. Water. Trout, they're precarious. Trout, they're fragile. They're very tough in a healthy ecosystem. ecosystem. But without it, they'll disappear. Uh, we've got to take <laughs> most of our land. We've got to be good protectors of our trout and other native species. Make sure and protect and preserve that heritage for our children and grandchildren to come. To come. This little family of uh, muskrat. Pretty cute. So if you love fishing the Provo in the canyon, right by the highway here, um, this is pretty nice. A couple of my favorite holes coming up. Um, Nobody on them, which is nice. Three of my favorite holes right here as they just kind of step up. Hopefully we'll see some fish moving in them. Just kind of take it nice and slow. Probably want to head down instead of spooking from up high. I don't see much bug action on the water, but we'll try a little subsurface first. Great little series of holes right here, though. It's coming some big fish in there, too. All right. This is a super nice little drop off, little drift. Really beautiful. Got a good feeling about this little spot. Oh, come on, that's about time. Oh, nice little brownie. Nice little jumper. Oh yeah. That corner of his mouth. Oh, he's probably he's probably thirteen. Nice. Okay, I've got some great little regular risers over here. Yeah. 
Put on the old Griffiths knot. If I can see. Coming up right out here. Put a little floaty on there. Not too much. Long distance release. All good. Got a couple of them coming up out here. Nice and soft. footers today. A little one footer. Boy, his belly's just all kinds of nervous. Nice. Nice. Oh, that's a good fish. Oh, well, that's the best fish of the day. That's a big brownie right there. Big brownie on a tiny Griffiths. Come on. Gotta be careful at 6X tippet. Come on. Careful. There's a 17 incher right there. That's a 17er. Oh, hell, Jess, look at that.